warm day today in the upper 60s i was getting used to the cold let's get out to the shop and see what we can do We got the goats making their way too close to the road. They know they're not supposed to be up here. I put a new child lock in this washer last night. Seems to be functioning. We're gonna test it with some clothes. If it all works out, we're gonna give it a good paint job. I salvaged out this dryer. We're gonna take it out to the scrap yard and put away all the parts that I stripped out of it. My dad brought up the old Zeter tractor we picked up a couple days ago. He's going to go over it, make sure all the maintenance is done. All the fluids are where they need to be. We got this washer back up and running. It's working like it should. Let's take it outside now and get it prepped up for a paint job. Got the washer facing the sun. That way the paint dries a little faster. Let's get this thing cleaned up. Some of the paint's already starting to fall off for us. I'm going to go through with the flathead, chip away any of the big stuff, sand it down real good, and then hit it with some appliance epoxy. All the loose paints chipped off. I put a shirt in there to catch any of the stuff from falling in the drum. Now we're going to go through and hand sand it. Got most of it taken down to bare metal. It's never going to be 100%, but it's more than enough. Put some tape over the sticker for the model number and the child lock. The rest of it, it won't hurt it if it gets oversprayed. Like always, I'm using appliance epoxy. It's the best stuff around for painting these kind of things. Looking good. I'm gonna let this dry and then I'll come back and touch it up. Brought the Polaris down to the shop. Haven't fired it on in weeks. Figured I'd try that out. Don't have a good battery for it. So we're gonna have to get it jumped off. So we got everything all hooked up. Quick check, make sure the gas is in there. Yeah, we got some gas. Kill switch was on. Let's give it another try. fired up with no problems i let it idle for a little bit it's kind of loud so i shut it off i don't have much use for it i don't ride it around a lot so i might try to get a battery for it and get it gone i brought this lg washer up here it's in rough shape if we get it fixed we can always paint it i'm not sure what's going on with it let's try to find out this paint job worked out great i gave it a slight touch up once that dries we'll get it taken inside lg washer finished out its first test cycle with no issues so I brought it inside, added some clothes. We're gonna test it again. I brought another washer out here. It needs a good cleanup. Let's hook it up and see what's going on. We have a couple issues with this washer. It needs a drain tube. The inlet valves are no good. They're all wore away. We'll have to get them replaced. And the child lock is malfunctioning. So I found all three of those parts. Let's get them installed. Last thing to do is pull out these old inlet valves. The ones that I have already have the wiring on them, so we're gonna replace that as well. Another day in the shop coming to an end. We'll be back out here tomorrow.